Okay, you're welcome. How's everyone doing today? Um, you're not gonna put it on the map, are you? Are you Malachar? Oh, aye, that's me. I need to speak with the prisoner. And why is that? Who might you be? Henry, envoy of Saradze Kobola. I'm here to investigate the attack. I'm sorry. I have other things on my mind right now. In case you hadn't noticed, we have pestilence raging here. And Saradze won't help us with that any more than he helped us when we were attacked. No news has reached Ratai of any disease here. But I'm here now, and I can help you. Hmm. Well, since you serve Sir Adzig, you might be of some use. If anyone can be. Tell me what to do. There's a stable hand living with us here, Matthias. Yes, I know him. And he knows some girl who helps out in the monastery infirmary. Your hanker, I think her name is. She might know someone to turn to. If she's actually there. Very well. I'll go to the monastery. Probably our best hope. Thank you. At least for taking the trouble. But then, even if you cared nothing for us, the prisoner's got the pestilence too. He'll die without help. If I have to go to the monastery, I need to know as much as possible about the disease. I'll definitely need to know its symptoms. They're bound to ask me that. It's hard to say. My wife is feverish. Others have the chills. I heard some are throwing up. Others still are breaking out in sores. But why don't you see for yourself? People talk a lot and I don't know what to believe anymore. Very well. I'll make the rounds. I've daubed lime on the afflicted houses. But don't stay too long in those homes. <laughs> that I can promise you. May the Lord watch over you. Jack. me for uh, no. Oh, no let me sleep Come for my wife. You're out of luck. I'm old Straw, don't you know? Straw, you've taken my son. But you shan't take my wife, you bastard. Calm down, Straw. You're telling me to calm down. Why the fuck should I be calm? Because if you don't calm down, I'll make you regret it. Oh, now we're talking. Oh, Come on, man, you bastard. Come on. I thought that it was cute. Well, 
Don't speak to me. Leave me be, all of you. Yeah. 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 Hanka? Uh, Henry? I'm glad to see you. 
Me too. I heard that you're doing well. Not right now. Matthias sent me. Matthias? My god, did something happen? I don't know if you've heard about it, but Merhoyev was attacked. Oh god! How is Matthias? Wounded in the arm. He's being brave about it, but his injury looks bad. I need to see him. Before you go, there's something else. What? Some kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoyev. Their livestock has died off, and now the people are coming down with it too. I thought maybe someone here might know what to do. Merciful heavens. How awful. It's a good thing you've come here. If there's any hope, this is the place to find it. You need brother Nicodemus, the monastery physician. He may know how to deal with it. Very well. I'll try to find him. Come back when you know more. Thank you, Johanka. Some kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoyev. Johanka said that you might be able to advise. A disease, you say? How intriguing. Yes, yes, it's very interesting, but can you help these people? I can't say at this point. I need to find out a little more. Tell me, has the whole village come down with it? No, I mean, not yet. Several households have, around half the village. Merhoyed? Isn't there a stud farm there? And what of the animals? Did they get infected too? Yes, there's a stud farm. But I don't know about the animals. What are we to do about it? Do you know the symptoms? Yes, more or less. Excellent. I have several extensive volumes here in the library. Describe the epidemic, including the symptoms, and we could take some guidance there. Can you read? I can't sleep again. Yes, I can. Excellent. So follow me to the scriptorium. So, where shall we start? Evidently there's something amiss in the digestive tract. In the what? The digestive tract, Henry. Um, right. Ah, the trouble lies between the mouth and the arsehole. Uh-huh. Sure. Just so. We can rule nothing out at this stage. You look in the Breviarum de Sickness Causa. It's a renowned manuscript from Salerno, written by one Johann of St. Paul. But I don't know Latin. Fortunately for you, our brother librarian is translating these momentous medical works into the common tongue. So you can still be of use. Study the breviary carefully and compare the symptoms with the recorded cases. That will guide us. I'll try the proven classics. Avicenna and his Canon Medicinae and Galen's Magnum Opus, the Ars Medicinalis. God be with you.
<clears throat> I think I have it. Yes? And what do you make of it? It's poisoning from tainted water. Really? That sounds rather unlikely. But if Master Johann of St. Paul's says so, who am I to contradict him? We shall have to prepare some medicine at once. I could help with that. Really? Yes. I know my way around the alchemistic arts. An ordinary fellow who knows the arts of physic? Who would have thought it? Excellent. I'll give you the recipe. And you have my permission to make use of the monastery laboratory. I'll get started right away. I, meanwhile, shall head straight to... Uh, where was it again? Merhoyeg. Oh, yes, Merhoyeg. I'll take Johanka with me. She has no equal in caring for the sick. Once you have the medication ready, hurry after me. Thank you, Brother Nicodemus. There's one man there who needs your care more urgently than anyone. He's an important witness in the investigation of some murders. Out of the question. I shall spend time with the sick in order of their medical needs, not your worldly needs. Would you teach me more about alchemy? Certainly. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. Now, pay close attention. I'm honored that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. Series. 